Ako yung ibang yung world ko, yung elite yung mga. Oo. Oo, iwan mo yun. Ang lakas na ba siya? Ang lakas na ba siya? Ah, yun. Ano ba yung sinabi ko doon? Ako naman. Habang, habang, hindi ito yung mundo ko. Habang, habang tumatagal, Lalo ko lang nararamdaman kung gaano kaliit at kasikip yung mundong pinanggalingan ko. Tama. And that was uh, actually a very good line of the movie. No? So, how do you feel now like us millennials? Does it really matter pa rin yung social status natin sa buhay when it comes to love relationship in the modern times? Uh, anyone can answer? No. <laughs> Social status, no, I don't believe that should matter. Um, obviously, for some people, it's a factor because you're talking about your future here, pero hindi naman talaga dapat eh. Kasi if you're talking about true love, kung sino naman ang mahanap mo na para sa'yo, hindi naman dapat po hindrance yung social class. I, I actually just posted on my social media the other day na I'm quite annoyed with so, um, superiority complex and elitists because I do believe that we're all equal and that, yeah, that we're all equal no matter our social class. So, no, I don't believe that should be a fact. Thank you. Ready na ka? Thank you. So, hindi nag-matter yung social class. Pag love, love is love eh. Hindi mo in-expect ng love. So, hindi sa, hindi sa itsura, hindi sa yaman, or hindi sa kasarihan, kung ano man. Basta kung love, love talaga eh. Wala mga pag-bigil. That's true. Ito, David. Ito ba ang comment? Hindi mo naman matuturuan yung love. So, feeling ko hindi dapat nag-matter yun. Uh, for me, love, love is love. Yeah, money, kinikita naman yun. So, pwede nang pwede maging kayo, and then afterwards you can work together to earn on the magiging plans for the future. Yeah. How about you, David? Since uh, sinasabi nila na yung so, sa, sa social status mo raw, so medyo more on actual sa ito in real life. Uh. Uh, I believe na, no? you don't choose who you fall in love with. Yes. Short but sweet. So just last part of question na lang, Michelle. So like, do like, um, meron bang like somebody who wants to approach you or to court you na feel nila na i-intimidate sila dahil uh, because of uh, your status or your celebrity status. I, I won't lie naman po na marami naman po nagtitry to court me. Pero wow. <laughs> marami nagpaparanda, marami nagpapa... Papa... Papa... <laughs> Nagpapapansin. Pero yung tanong nyo po is if nagmamatter yung social class or na-intimidate. Oh. Like, do you feel that the guy, parang ayaw niya ituloy? Ayaw niya like, ituloy oh. yung courtship because na-intimidate sa akin. Well, ayaw ko naman po to get into a relationship with somebody who can't handle me. So, uh, talaga hindi ko papansin yung mga yun. Why do I have to... Marami <laughs> naman. Obviously, like I said kanina, parang hindi naman nag-matter yung social class. Pero it does, the personality of the person will matter. So, if yung tao hindi ako kaya i-approach, then, paano ko malalaman na, na gusto niya ako? Um, I feel like I give off the impression nga na mahirap, na medyo hard to, ano ba? Hard to, hard to approach, medyo matagay daw ako may tignan minsan. Pero, I assure you naman po, na once na kilala niyo, hindi naman Thank you. Thank you, Michelle. We have a question from Han inside Manila. Hello, Michelle. Hello. 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 Hello
Hello, good afternoon. So, um, this question goes to everyone. So, I just want to ask, um, how did Because I Love You uh, hold, uh, help hone your um, skills as actors and actresses? How did the movie hone your skills as an actor or actress? Actually, you know, um, some movie because I love you. You don't realize that, uh, you know, uh, David Kaufman could actually be an actor. Um, because before this movie, I wasn't really, honestly, I wasn't really into it, pa. Um, but like, surely I had to work on it. I had to work on my craft and the acting, the workshop, and all that. So, then actually, it's a long, big turning point, talaga siya for my career, for my acting career. So. Yeah. Ako naman, um, since uh, si Derek Joel, director namin, and nakatrabaho na siya sa TV, feeling ko, with his guidance, parang uh, iba, iba pala yung, yung kailangan sa mupag sa movie. Kumbaga, iba, iba yung effort na dapat mong ibigay kasi mas nakakapagod yung movie gawin. Maraming shots, maraming uh, da daming ulit. Pero ito, movie na to, feeling ko ang dami ko pang, uh, dami ko na-improve. Lalo na kasi yung character ko dito, medyo paguran, physical siya, nakapagod. And siguro dito ko na-test yung patience ko. And yung patience ko sa pagdating sa mga ganitong character na kung kaya ko ba talaga. And na, masasabi ko na kinaya ko siya at nakaya ko siya na palindigan ko yung character ko dito. So, malaking malaking tulong siya na ma-realize ko kung ano pa yung kaya kong gawin dito sa industriya. Actually, yung, again, this film is my first film. And it came shortly after I expressed my interest to act. So, nung nalaman ko na si Derek Joel lamangan yung director, sobrang kinabahan po ako. But I felt that it was a very good training ground for me to step into the industry. Ayun po, shortly after that, I signed with GMA, and I feel like the movie really helped me. Um, it gave me the necessary tools and experiences to, to, to give to GMA as well. So. Uh, I want to mention this. Medyo medyo matagal na rin sa showbiz, mga 10 years. Sa dami nung nagawang roles, na miss kong gumawa ulit ng mas light, mas light na story, mas simple, pero yet um, maraming matututunan na nagkikiligid dito. So, um, kasi madalas na no, kukuha ko yung madalas lady, gay rose or may December affair, or ang daming mabibigat na more uh, more mature. Dito, na-experience ko ulit maging bata, uh, playboy, millennial, na maluloko na. So, ang sarap paglaruan. For me naman, uh, yung role ko kasi dito is makulit. So, it applies in personal. So, makulit ako sa personal life. And for the acting naman, it helps, it helps me mold myself na if ever I'll have more uh, projects, it helps me talaga. So, oh, I hope na marami. Thank you. Thank you, Tim. We have a question from Rain, the Obama. Hi. Um, question ko lang kasi uh, alam naman natin sa, sa, local, uh, sa local production natin. Puro marami tayong nilalabas ng uh, romantic uh, films, uh, love story. Uh, how would you sell this movie? Kasi um, the problem is, marami tayong, marami kasi kasabay o marami sumasabay ng mga films sa atin. How would you sell this na yung mga fans o yung mga gusto man makapanood ng mga romantic films like this na visitahin tong cinema and then watch this film? Siguro sa akin, uh, di, masasabi ko na medyo common siya. Pero yung mga characters namin dito, hindi parehas ng mga ibang movie na lumabas na at pinabalabas ngayon. At sa tingin ko, isa yung edge ng movie na to is yung may makita naman silang bagong mukha. Na pwedeng may ma-offer sila na bago. Na yung pag-acting ng mga artista, yung si Derek Joel na nagko-comedy, nagro-rompong. So, madaming, madaming bago sa movie na to na dapat nilang makita. And pinaghandaan, ginastusan, maganda yung effort na binigay at, su at, su at support na binigay ng management ng GMA. 
So I think uh, worth it siyang panoodin. Another thing then po is hindi kami tinipin. So we can assure that the quality will be very high. Unlike the other films that I've, I've watched this, this film compared to others, the quality is very good po. Um, again, what Shire said, it's also directed by Direct Joe Lamangan, so it sets the bar high. Then we also have actors like Martin Del Rosario, Victor Baspo, who have really, really good, Victor Basso, sorry, um, who have really good fan bases also. And uh, I think it will do well. And we uh, we have a good niche for that. Um, ako naman, sabi kasi ni Ail, yung aspiration na movie na to. So, I'm sure maraming girls yung mag imagine na uh, magpo-fall in love sila sa isang very rich, handsome, debonair, opa, ganyan, di ba? Tapos si Shana naman yan, medyo parang clumsy, na simple, na sweet. So, wala lang, inspirational yung movie. Maraming mag 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 mga ngarap na maging sila si Shana or si Dave. Wattpad to eh. Ang daming readers ng Wattpad. So maraming makakarili. And sobrang clean ngayon ng K-drama. So dito nila makikita yung Pinoy flavor. Diba? Ay, just a follow up. <laughs> Kasi yun yung na-mention na ni Shaira na this is taken. I, I don't know kung masasagot. Masa